alcohol. I'm Dana Scully. I'm Agent Mulder's partner. What are his vitals? He's suffering from extreme hypothermia. No, you've got to get him out of the tub. He's dying. He's lost all his body. You've got to listen to me. If you keep him in there, you're going to kill him. The cold is the only thing that's keeping him alive. His heart stopped. Give me one if I've ever been in a cannula. You don't know what you're dealing with here. Agent Mulder has been exposed to a retrovirus resulting in hyperviscosity syndrome. I want you out of my ER right now. Nurse. Uh, yes, ma'am. His blood has thickened. That's why his heart is failing. His heart is failing because he's lost all his body heat. No, the only thing saving him right now is the hypometabolic state induced by the cold. Now, if you don't do what I'm saying, you are going to kill him. Let's get him out of that tub now. Jill's charge and ready. Clear. Clear. No rhythm. Charge. No. Clear. Clear. I'm picking up a faint pulse. I want a Dijoxin 0.1 milligram IV. Hang a heparin drip at 1,000 units per hour and get him two units of fresh frozen plasma now. This patient's not even He's clear. going to make it. Transfusions and an aggressive treatment with antiviral agents have resulted in a steady but gradual improvement in Agent Mulder's condition. Blood tests have confirmed his exposure to the still unidentified retrovirus, whose origin remains a mystery. The search team that found Agent Mulder has located neither the missing submarine nor the man he was looking for. Several aspects of this case remain unexplained suggesting the possibility of paranormal phenomena. But I am convinced that to accept such conclusions is to abandon all hope of understanding the scientific events behind them. Many of the things I have seen have challenged my faith and my belief in an ordered universe. But this uncertainty has only strengthened my need to know, to understand, to apply reason to those things which seem to defy it. It was science that isolated the retrovirus Agent Mulder was exposed to. And science that allowed us to understand its behavior. And ultimately, it was science that saved Agent Mulder's life. you to Eisenhower Field. Thanks for ditching me. Thank you. 